want to experience a classic drift from a BMW M4 like this? Why are they rushing like crazy on the road? Why put yourself in danger? And I think you should restrain your speed so that you can handle unexpected situations. I learned so much from my mistakes, so I decided to do more mistakes so that I can learn more. Looks like he ended up in handicapped parking. To be exact, so keep a close eye on the parking spot as well as control the speed intelligently. I think that after this collision it is very difficult to restore the car to its original condition and hope the driver is okay. Oh no man, treat carefully between such detours or improve your driving technique to avoid such situations. What happened? Be careful bro, maybe you're trying to perform right? I think you broke the law, please pay attention next time. I think it was probably because he deliberately ran away from the police to cause such panic attacks. And I hope the next time you go out on the road, control your speed as best you can and handle the situation better. Why do people not understand a simple but extremely reasonable saying, drive on the right, or take on the left? It's dangerous to try to pass on the right, man. What are they even looking at? I don't know how they can't see you unless not looking. I think we should be more careful when going to avoid collision. They didn't signal and didn't have enough room for the lane change. But why didn't you simply back up and avoid the accident? Be careful. Pierdzielony. What that guy said about torque and the engine's rev range, plus the 911 has got plenty of grip on the driving wheels, which is why it understood around 50 seconds instead of wiping the back around. Wow, that's amazing. With such a skilled drift, he probably has to practice for a long time to be able to do it like that. Definitely repairable if you have enough money. Should be an easy fix as long as you know how to weld structural parts together. I think after the restoration of this car, 
Perhaps the owner will not want to take it out on the street because of the obsession with collisions. That's fixable unless it does massive damage on the chase. But I hope that after it is restored, the owner of the car will know how to take care of it. It seems that there was a fairly strong impact that caused the car to deform like that. It's scary and dangerous. Hopefully, there isn't a passenger in it. I guess we all know what happened here. Perhaps due to a terrible collision or a phase of self-destruction of this honored supercar? Anyway, I don't expect this to be a horrible collision to happen. driver of a Vauxhall Corsa lost control on a bend and collided with a parked vehicle in a wall on Saturday around 1.20 a.m. Shocking photos show the aftermath of the horrific collision with the red car lying next to a destroyed wall. At least 17 people were injured when two car crashed and plopped into the crowd watching boy racers on July 19, 2019. Masked thugs throw paper tools at the windshield of a police car during a high-speed pursuit over a stolen catalytic converter in Oldham, Greater Manchester. It seems that these thieves escaped from the policemen after this stab. These two men were seen in hot pursuit along the side of a dual carriageway after one had appeared to deliberately ram the other in Sydney, Australia. And perhaps this intense pursuit made the man in the orange vest angry and overreacted. Shocking CCTV footage shows a man skulking around the corner before running and jumping into the vehicle, before putting his foot down and speeding off on July 27. And maybe he was too shocked to see his Mercedes stolen and tried to give chase in front of his children. When the collision from the wrong front of the container truck from this car was recorded by dash cam on the following car in Akron, Ohio, USA. This was a crash that happened on his way home from work. The truck went out of his lane and hit a white van, causing the van to do a 360 and smash into the wall. But luckily, there was only damage to the car and no one was injured in this collision. This is probably the luckiest car I've seen as he avoids a collision from this very Tesla autopilot mode recorded in Las Vegas, Nevada, USA. When he was on autopilot and accidentally avoided a collision with the truck next to him when he changed lanes. Luckily for him, he narrowly avoided a collision using the autopilot system. Perhaps this is also the biggest lesson of his driving journey. This stray wheel seems to have caused this truck to lose control on the road and was recorded by Dashcam in Thailand. When this truck was moving very normally, the rear wheel of the vehicle began to show signs of leaving the vehicle. And just a few seconds later, this stray wheel rolled on the road, causing other cars to be afraid. But fortunately, this stray wheel did not cause collisions with other cars, and the car that left off the wheel also stopped in time. Still, the train tracks stuck on the dash cam recorded happened in Columbus Grove, Ohio, USA, when this container seemed to have been stuck on the tracks for too long and still no one came to help it. With minutes, the train arrived and hit it directly. Oh my gosh. But luckily for it, the people in this container got out of this vehicle. It's too dangerous. 
just a little more carelessness in his driving would cause him a crash that was captured on camera in Springfield, Illinois, USA. Towing a trailer with a skid steer that Foreman loaded got on the highway and it got loose when he got to about 45 or 50 miles per hour. But fortunately for him, he suddenly realized the danger and stopped in time. I just done and the guy goes, man, I love your stallion bit, but it's real close to Patrice's sharp. And I, the second he said that, I went, oh my God, it's almost identical. Oh my God. I don't know. Truly. And is that a female or a male name or a we, can it be? A son, truce, and a daughter, yeah. truly. Oh my okay. okay. truce. Yeah, truce. truce. Oh my god. The truck that overturned shortly after hitting the bridge was captured by the dash cam of the vehicle following in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, USA. When this ill fated truck was carrying quite bulky things and traveling at a very fast speed, it could not control the direct collision with the bridge, so it overturned in just a few seconds. But luckily, someone called 911 to rescue the people trapped in the truck. Perhaps God also protected their own safety. Weather is always a mysterious factor that causes unexpected collisions that make us very unpredictable. And the, and the video below is a slippery road that caused a collision of two cars in Kirov. Perhaps because of the road surface is quite slippery, it makes the cars go so much more. Perhaps because the road surface is quite slippery, it makes the car go much more carefully. But the driver of the white car going in the opposite direction runs at a very fast speed, and accidentally it crashed into the truck. Maybe it's just damage to two cars, but I hope everyone on board is safe. There was almost a collision that was recorded by Dashcam in Guelph, Ontario, Canada. This pickup truck decided a good place to do a U-turn was in front of a fully loaded 140,000 pound semi going downhill. Once he realized what was happening, he had the brake pedal on the floor to try to stop in time. Maybe he was absolutely expecting a collision, but was spared by literally inches. Turned the corner to approach the crossing and found the tractor trailer stopped on the tracks with the crossing guard down and the lights flashing. The train hit the trailer, which must have cut the brake lines to the tractor which rolled off the road after the impact. No one, to my knowledge, was hurt.